The astonishing reason behind the unique appearance of this boy surprised everyone. Life is full of surprises, especially if you are Brock Brown. Brock is a boy from Michigan who stunned the entire world with his unusual appearance. And this story is not about his unbelievable outlook, but about the stunning reason behind his unique appearance. No doubt the reason will shock you. But what would shock you more from within is the slew of revelations that follows the disclosure of the root cause. His life story is a perfect mix of every sentiment that includes love, pain, happiness, and most importantly, lots of pupil dilating surprises. Read this story out and get to know how different it is to be different. This astounding story comes from Michigan. It started when Darcy Moss Elliott gave birth to Brock Brown, who was about to stun everyone in the future. He was born at a healthy size as the infant weighed about 8 pounds and was about 22 inches long. He was a normal infant like other ones, but surely did not have a normal future like them. Darcy Elliott did not expect at the time what she was going to witness. Physical growth is the most common phenomena in a developing child, but it certainly was not common with this child. Despite having a normal delivery, the boy began to grow abnormally. That obviously shocked his family, but they did not know it was just the beginning, as it was the reason behind his unusual growth that was going to make their jaw drop. Brock was a happy-go-lucky kind of kid in his childhood. He had normal growing years, except the fact that he never had to listen to about their physical structure. Apparently, he was way taller than his friends and surprisingly continued to grow incessantly. No doubt his childhood shocked everyone, but there was more to come. He completely knocked people's socks off when he got admitted into kindergarten. What they saw was totally an unexpected sight that will make you raise your brows too. The boy continued to surprise others with his abnormal growth. Another instance happened when he took admission in the kindergarten. Whereas normally the average height of an American five-year-old kindergartner is under four feet. For some strange reason, when Brock entered his kindergarten, he was about five foot two inches tall. Shocking, right? Now, along with his mother, everyone who came across this extraordinary kid was baffled by his appearance. Little did they know that the root cause of his uncommon growth was going to confound them even more. Read further to know about the shocking revelation that completely changed the entire life of Brock and his family. At the age of mere six, he reached the height of his mother. No doubt it was uncomfortable for his mother, but there was nothing they could do about it except get astonished again and again. Being his mother, Darcy got really concerned about her kid's unbelievable condition. His aunt, Stacy Snyder, shedding light on his extraordinary growth, said, When he was small, he couldn't ride a bike. But when you're trying to teach a six-year-old who's the same size as you, it's hard. You can't stabilize him. Evidently, his continuous growth was impeding his mental growth and physical abilities. But these problems were nothing placed before the horrendous trouble that was going to strike him in the near future. Raising a rapidly growing child is not something everyone can do. No need to say Darcy, too, was not ready for this unexpected happening. But the one thing that distinguishes her from the others is her gentle way of handling the situation. Due to Brock's rapid growth, his mother faced myriad problems, including the health-related ones, while taking care of her not-so-little kid. According to her, when you have a five-year-old who has hurt themselves and they come running at you, you pick them up, she added. I would carry him around when he was half the size of me, so I have a lot of back problems. His mother was yet to get another shock from her life that was just on the horizon. The eye-widening vertical growth of Brock continued even in his teens. Usually school kids stop growing in their teenage years, but Brock had a different story. He was the tallest kid in his class. The boy kept on shooting up through his middle school, making him a subject of discussion among his school fellows. Despite his stunning upward growth, the extraordinary Michigan boy Brock Brown was still a kid with ordinary hobbies. He likes fishing and hanging out with his friends. Imaginably, he must be the one attracting more attention than any of his friends. For obvious reasons, you can gauge his unbelievable pace of sprouting up by the fact that he stood at six feet high at the age of 11. And by the time he reached 14, he had outgrown the doors of his classrooms. To some extent, Brock too enjoyed the attention of people. 
but all his ecstasy got mired in gloom when he learned the reason behind his unusual growth. As expected, the ceaseless growth of Brock turned up as a big hurdle in his mental and physical development. The impact was so huge that he had to face a big amount of pain in doing the most common day-to-day -day business. Be it standing for hours, passing through doors, and riding in his car, all these imperceptible activities by general people pose regular problems to him. Not just that, unlike common people, Brock faced difficulties going to restaurant booths, stepping in movie theaters, and going any small space place. All credit goes to his majestic height. Despite these difficulties, lively Brock continued to live his life blissfully until he found out why he was growing so rapidly. With several other things, Brock has outgrown his bed also. He is growing rapidly with six inches a year that comes a hurdle in his comfort. However, his parents have taken some steps to make his life more comfortable. His room is laced with some special types of furniture. He sleeps on a custom-made eight-foot bed and sits on a distinctive chair that is worth a thousand dollars. His unique bedroom that is occupied by many expensive types of furniture is very convenient for the ever-growing boy. Brock has the habit of sleeping up to 16 hours a day that has now become more comfortable with his lengthy bed. Clothing problem is very normal in families with growing kids that get sorted when the kids cease to grow after a certain age. But this family's clothing problem continued to grow with the growing of Brock Brown. And perceiving the condition of him, it seems that there is no solution to it in offing. Due to his rapid growing height, he fell short of suitable clothes. The condition was so extreme that the parents of Brown had to buy him new specially designed clothes almost every month. He required rudimentary clothing staple too, leading to building of big financial pressure on the family. But as they say, no financial pressure can compete with the emotional one that this family was about to undergo. The family has always stood tall with him. They have always tried to cater to every tiny need for him. On the other hand, he does not have many demands. He can go on with one pair of shoes for months. Even after being a teen, he never complains about anything, nor does he ever desire for something really very expensive to show off. The size of his socks is 28 feet that are worth $20 per pair. He does not have a big collection of boots and sandals like his other teenage friends, but the point is that he does not need it either. Just like the body, Brock has a big heart too. Though he can't help but let go awkward ogling of people on him, he decided to deal with all these uncomfortable situations with a big smile on his face. Everybody knows about his sporting nature, including his family members. Aunt Stacy says he takes on his condition day by day with a smile on his face. His mother further adds, overall he is a big softy. His heart is as big as his body. He loves to meet people and make friends. This extraordinary tall man has a very sweet nature and is capable of impressing others. This amazing personality has only one request that springs out of this situation. In 2016, Brock participated in the TLC documentary named Tallest Teens. The documentary is about some of the teens who have unusual heights. It boosted the confidence of Brock in a big moment, who had never seen people like him before participating in the show. The event came as a big relief for Brock as he got a chance to gel up with people having unique body sizes like him. Meeting with people like him was indeed a surreal experience for him. According to his mother, Brock felt very positive after going there and helped him to form an optimistic view of his state. Brock's height problem was getting grave day by day. Now he was not only the tallest person in his surroundings, but also in his town. No doubt his mother started getting really worried about her son's health. Consequently, she took him to the doctor for the checkup. The medical professional did some tests on him in order to find out what exactly was wrong with him. It was not an easy moment for the family who was up on their toes to know the reason. On the other hand, Brock himself was very curious to know why he was growing constantly. Finally, the result came in. The result shocked everyone from his family members to Brock himself. At the age of five, Brock got diagnosed with a rare disease. The illness is unusual in the sense that only one person in every 15,000 people has this disease. It came as a big shock for the family, 
the doctor disclosed that Brock was suffering from a hereditary condition called Soto syndrome that is also known as cerebral gigantism. In this condition, the victim never ceases to grow. When Darcy heard about her son's illness, she got even more worried. There's nothing that can stop him from growing. I don't know if he will ever stop, Darcy said. These slew of revelations had put a big question mark on Brock's future, and it was not enough. Another shock bigger than this one was awaiting them. Darcy was yet to emerge out of the grief of her son's ruining health when another devastating news struck her. The doctor further maintained that there are high chances that Brock would not be able to survive this disease beyond his teenage years. After learning the truth, the whole family was shattered. What worsened the matter was the fact that there was no standard treatment for this disease. The genetic disorders like this are medicated on the ground of symptomatics. It indeed took a long time for Darcy to pull herself together. As far as Brock is concerned, despite his life-threatening condition, he went on to live his life to the fullest. It was all because of his lively nature that he got to witness some really unbelievable moments in his life. No, you don't have to check Wikipedia to know about the symptoms of Soto Syndrome. We will acquaint you with this rarely found life-risking disease here. People who fall victim to this rare disease suddenly begin to grow in a rapid manner. The stunning growth is usually noticed in the early age that extends to their teenage years. Those diagnosed with this syndrome grow faster than their siblings and friends. Brock had all these symptoms in him that made the case crystal clear for medical professionals. The news got followed by many other shocking revelations. No doubt it was difficult for his family to bear this pain, but there was another big shocking news that was going to dawn on them very soon. This incoming news undoubtedly turned their life upside down. As mentioned before, the people with this syndrome are taller than ordinary people, and Brock Brown topped even those with this syndrome. His abnormal health became a point of worry for his family. He kept on growing at an unsteady pace even after the checkup. The doctor already had pronounced that he was not going to live past his teens. That was enough to distress his family. It was when Brown was 14 that another pronouncement came from the doctor about him that was actually very troublesome. The doctor said that he wouldn't be able to survive after 15. His disease is clubbed with a number of health issues. People with Soto syndrome usually have heart problems. Brown has a strain on his heart, a curvature of the spine, intermittent explosive disorder, some learning defects, and ADHD. It is not the end of his ordeal. He was born with one kidney, that makes him unable to have painkillers, even if he suffers from chronic pain. It kind of feels like a big tennis racket has gone through my back, says Brock. I do stuff to stop it hurting, and it makes me feel like there's a needle gone through it. It's hard to deal with. He has suffered problems like this many times and continues to do so. Surprisingly, his disease has not given him just pain. He went on to break many records in his short lifespan. Despite the doctor's declaration about his lifespan, he succeeded in going past 15. What made his life more interesting was the fact that he has surmounted several records in his celebrated life. He already was a popular figure in his hometown that is occupied by about 30,000 residents in Michigan. His popularity transcended the limits when in 2015, he won the Guinness World Record title of the world's tallest teenager until he crossed 19 that made him too old to hold this title. In order to get the title, Brown had taken a lead on Kevin Bradford, a fellow tall teen. The winning of this record was just the harbinger of many more achievements he was going to bag in the future. And yeah, not to forget another astonishing pronouncement about him by the doctor that made a huge impact on his already successful life. The months got changed into years, but his growth rate remained the same. At 19, the Michigan boy stands at 7 feet 8 inches, way taller than any member of his family. His mother claims that he continues to grow at a rate of 6 inches a year. If that is true, and he keeps on growing at this pace, not far is the day when he will get taller than the current record holder of the world's tallest man. His unbelievable life story has dumbstruck people. It is amazing that instead of bowing down to his untreatable condition, he preferred utilizing it in a positive way. This was just the beginning of his marvelous life that got a new meaning when hit by another jaw-dropping announcement. Brock Brown reappeared on television in 2016 with The Maury Show. 
He had come on the show's special anti-bullying episode. It is imaginable that he himself was bullied a lot in school. In the show, Darcy narrated the troubles they confronted that, of course, included Brock being bullied constantly by the mischievous people. After that, she rooted for the halting of such improper practices. The Maury team presented Brock with some heartfelt gifts that constituted a new wheelchair and 10-year supply of fish sticks made by Gordon, his favorite chef. Along with that, his life had many more surprises in store for him. His appearance on The Maury Show provided to be a big milestone for him. It grew his fan following list. Many people came to his side after listening to his thought-provoking story in the episode. Post the show, many instances occurred when he was contacted by his supporters with positive messages. Brock and his family also heard from people having Soto Syndrome. The family felt great comfort after listening to other people, but there was one more lurking medical hurdle in their way that was going to pop out soon. As we all know, the family of Brock had to face big financial issues due to his rarely found clothes and comforting items of furniture. The family had come up with a Facebook page called the supporting page for Brock D. Brown. After the featuring of Brock in the TLC's documentary, the likes of the page leapt up to 15,000. Many Michigan people expressed their desire to help them out. Darcy admired all of them with an overwhelmed heart. The support from every corner garnered him about $10,400. People helped the family in many different ways, ranging from financial help to providing tickets to a Detroit Pistons basketball game where Brock got an opportunity to meet some renowned players. The family themselves had never thought the ripple their constant appearances created leading to the flood of support. However, yet they were about to overcome their financial problems. According to his mom, didn't last long. We had a lot of outfits, but within a year he was out of them and it was time to do it all again. Thanks to the love and funds from the people, Brock got his hands on comforting footwear at an affordable price. The pair of shoes was designed by Feats, a California-based company. It came up with a 3D printing that slashed the price by half in relation to the regular custom shoe. There was no limit to his ecstasy when he got his first pair of shoes. He exclaimed, heck, I don't like them, I love them, thank you. The family was all high on joy, oblivious to the coming news that had the capability to stun them all. Due to his gigantic size, Brock has always had problems fitting in smaller spaces that deprived him of much joy. For instance, he could never get into the movie theater comfortably, and driving a car was like a big challenge for him. And not to forget his chronic spine pain. In order to get these problems addressed, Brock and Darcy undertook a thousand-mile flight to Arkansas to consult an expert. Their visit was full of surprising news. He met Soto specialist Dr. Bradley Schaefer over there. The chief geneticist stated that Brock can get rid of his chronic spine pain. It was during this trip that Darcy and her son got enlightened with one more exotic fact that they previously had no idea about. Dr. Schaefer revealed that Brock was out of life-threatening danger. Brock is easily the tallest man I have ever seen, said Dr. Schaefer. Unfortunately, he will always have to deal with some form of pain, but I believe that he will now have a regular lifespan, said Dr. Schaefer. The cheering news was followed by the much heartwarming response. After hearing the news, Brock could not help but grin ear to ear. He said, it's the best thing I could have heard. He further added, I'm so happy that I will live for a long time. Usually, the people with Soto Syndrome reach their peak height in adulthood. It is yet to see if that is going to be the case with Brock. It's unlikely that he would be able to live his life all alone. That is why his family has some very heart-melting expectations for his future. All they want is to have their beloved son stay happy. It is speculated that Brock would be the one surpassing the current tallest man if he continues to grow at this rate. Currently, the title is held by Turkey Sultan Kosin, with a towering 8 feet 2 inches. Not just Brock's size, but also his cheerful nature has surprised everyone. Not many people have the tendency to take on the odds with a big smile. Instead of getting terrified, Brock envisions a very bright future for himself. He might dethrone Kosin at the age of 21, given that he continues to grow at the same pace. 
Brock stated, I hopefully want to work for a sporting goods store, so something like that, a cashier or something. I just want to have my own job. Darcy and her son long for a bright future for Brock together. Darcy loves her son enough to not force him to do anything. According to her, I just hope he has a good life and is happy with everything.